What are cannabinoids? What are the secrets of the substances within the cannabis plant? Cannabinoids are important class of compounds derived from cannabis sativa. They exhibit profound psychopharmacological activities. The cannabinoids are found to act by binding with non-specific cell membranes thereby modify dopamine transmission. Complete understanding of cannabinoid chemistry gave several related compounds. Now cannabinoids are used to fight dreaded diseases like Alzheimer's, Lugers, diabetes mellitus, cancer etc. Research is progressing so that new analogs are developed which will be acting as powerful weapons in the fight against many dreaded diseases. Cannabinoids are a group of terpenophenolic compounds. This complicated name is assembled from the words terpene and phenol. Terpene is an organic compound that naturally occurs in the form of resin, like the one that is produced from trees. These compounds have high viscosity and a sharp odor. Phenol is an aromatic compound which means that it's usually composed out of a ring of six carbons and a hydroxyl group, hydrogen bonded to oxygen. Naturally occurring phenol are found in many organisms such as capsaicin in hot peppers, estrogen in the human body and many other places. These compounds have a tarry and very sickening sweet smell. Natural cannabinoids, phytocannabinoids. These cannabinoids, which are also called naturally occurring, herbal and classic cannabinoids, are the cannabinoids that are naturally synthesized in great quantities within the cannabis plant and are concentrated in the glandia structures known as trichomes. These substances are insoluble in water but soluble in oils, alcohols and other apolar compounds. Among these compounds, the most popular are THC, CBD and CNB. CBD, this compound is colorless crystalline at room temperature. The substance itself is not psychoactive, and even showed antipsychotic properties in some studies. As for pharmacological properties, cannabidiol showed many important effects such as antidimer, antimetic, Alzheimer's inhibition and more. DHC, in its isolated form, tetrahydrocarbonyl usually is solute and storing it is difficult due to its light sensitivity. THC is a psychoactive substance that operates on activation of CB1 receptors, which causing at the end to a decrease in camp concentration in the body. Yet along THC is a known pain reliever that was studies and shows more properties such as calming effect, aggression decreaser, antitemic and increasing of appetite. CBN, cannabinol usually is found in small concentrations in the cannabis plant. It is a weak psychoactive substance with weak affinity to CB1 receptor yet shows strong affinity to CB2 receptors. Studies that were taken, showed that it is a good pain reliever. Body-made cannabinoids, endogens. Endocannabinoids or endogenous cannabinoids are substances produced within the human or other animals and these trigger the cannabinoid receptors in the endocannabinoid system. The most distinctive of them is called an andamide. Anandamide, this compound is a essential fatty acid neurotransmitter which means, humans and other animal must digest it in order to maintain good health. It was first isolated and its structure figured in 1992 by a research group that was led by Raphael Makulam from the Hebrew University in Jerusalem. Synthetic cannabinoids. Laboratory synthesis of cannabinoids is based on the structure of natural cannabinoids and a large number of similar compounds was produced and tested. Newer compounds are no longer related to natural occurring cannabinoids or based on the same structure of endocannabinoids. Synthetic cannabinoids are mainly used in experiments to determine the relations between a structure and the activity of the cannabinoid compound. The most familiar synthetic cannabinoid compounds known today are nabilone and levonidrol. Nabilone, this registered drug has used as a pain reliever and antitemic. The substance mimics the structure of THC and although it was not shown that it's widely effective, some studies at Mexico showed that this drug relieves the lives of fibromyalgia and multiple sclerosis patients. Levonidrol, an analog of dronabinol. The registered drug levonidrol is estimated 30 times potent more than THC. 
The substance shows pain-relieving properties and anti-temizity through activation of CB1 cannabinoid receptor. Although the drug is not widely used due to the success of nabilone, the molecules is still being studied in order to better know its pharmacological properties.